Today I'm gonna be showing you a little bit about the Goblin Espresso cart funded by the Harrison Public Schools. The Goblin Espresso, um, well it started at the end of the year last year with Miss Tabor who's now over in Miss Lax's spot. And it began with the idea to let the extended resource class branch out and grow in a way that they haven't grown because this is a new class. It's just a great way for them to get out, see their teachers, to uh, learn so many different social skills, learn math. Miss <coughs> Spar comes down from the high school, so it's really cool that we all get to interact, we get to work together, and we get to expand what we do and how we do it because when we connect, all the kids learn that much better and the coffee cart just allows us to do that. Well, actually, um, it started last year. I started seeing um, different life skills, self-contained classes doing this and it was really benefiting for the children. So um, my boss and I, my supervisor, Bridget Bright, and I started getting together and we started um, thinking about this and she kind of put the idea in my head. This teaches them life skills, it has money handling, preparation, following and order, um, just and other basic life skills like communicating with someone and talking to them and being able to have those skills that they'll need when they actually get out of school. The Harrison Public Schools Foundation very generously set us up with a grant for $1,800 um, and we are working on our, we, this is actually at the middle school of course, but our high schoolers are working on uh, a bake sale as part of our work program uh, and so all our bake sale money goes back into the fund and the idea is that our work program will be self-sustaining so that we'll be able to afford to buy all the supplies and things we need for the bake sale from the, the bake sale money, uh, which is great. And uh, we're doing this so that our high schoolers uh, who are in life skills or extended resource can have some vocational skills that they can turn into jobs uh, after they graduate. So it's a really important part of our, our work program, our vocational education program.